What is a heat loss calculation? Okay, so if you, especially if you live in an old house, you can sort of experience this more. You walk in, um, the place is drafty and cold, and you, if you go to the windows, you can feel drafts and so on. And essentially, what we have to do is try and estimate how much heat pours out of your building. There are lots of ways of doing it, but essentially what we do is we take the size of the, the room, so how big are the walls and the windows and the floor and, and the um, ceiling, and we then have to look at how well insulated um, it is. So if you think about a Victorian house, I'm sure many of your viewers have one of these with the, with the vented wooden floor, you walk around on the floor, the floor's freezing cold, and because there's no insulation, of course, if you insulated that, the amount of heat that went through the floor would be less. So it's just like wearing a jumper, I guess. You could do a heat load calculation on your clothes. If you wear three jumpers, the insulation is good, so you're lovely and warm. If you wear one jumper, the heat pours out of you, and so you are cold. So my job is to work out essentially how much heat leaks out of each room of your house. That is all the heat load calculation is.